Oh, dude, chunk. This is a chunk. Oh, look at this. Look at this fish. Oh, come on. Come on, babe. Get in the boat. Oh, yeah. That is a fall fish right there, guys. That is a fall fish. That is a fall fish right there. Hit the hit the side one. I thought I was gonna hit the back one, but that is a fat fish. Look at that. Got a gut on him. All right, so caught that fish on the Shane's Baits finesse mini. Got those Kai Tech 2.8s on there in Tennessee shad color, and that's a good two and a half, three pounder. He's got a gut on him. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this guy in live well so and get some pictures. I'm gonna cast back out on this ledge. I was using this fish finder, um, my little Lawrence X4 Pro. And I saw a bunch of fish lined up on a, uh, a deep ledge. So I'll put this guy in live well and we'll hopefully get some more. All right, so I don't know if you guys can see me too well or not, but there is a ledge right here. It's showing a bunch of fish in this, on my little Lawrence X4 Pro. Um, and I can feel these fish hit it when I'm pulling off the ledge. They're just not, not uh, inhaling it. I feel them thumping at it. Like there's one right there. There's one. Ooh. Coming toward me. Doesn't feel as big as the last one, but I may be wrong. Yeah, he's not as big as the last one. Little guy. Little guy. Right there, again, that Shane's Bates Finesse Mini. Don't want him to hook me when I. I'm grabbing them. Lots of hooks flying everywhere. Let me get back on that point. But got them right there in the mouth and then another one in the side. Get this guy good in the side. There we go. Definitely not as big as the last one. Super fat though. And just waiting on that point, waiting for some fish to come over it, so. Put this guy in live well too. Get back out there. So this is the smaller one I got. Put him back. And then here's the bigger one. I don't know if you guys can see or not, but in the last couple clips, I did catch two fish. It was getting really dark and very fast. So I didn't get a fish, but for only 30 to 45 minutes, and it's pitch black right now, it's only about 6 o'clock. Um, so kind of a bummer. I didn't get a fish as much as I wanted to, but I did catch two fish in about 30 minutes, so that's very good. Um, but what I was using to catch these fish was the 2.8 Tennessee Shad Kitek swim baits. These come in uh, many different sizes. This was just a 2.8 inch. And actually, when I caught one of those fish, and its mouth was a little shad about that big. So perfect, uh, perfect size for catching those fish. Again, Kitek little swim baits. And the actual Alabama rig I was using is by Shane's Baits. And I do believe it is called the Finesse Mini or Mini Finesse. I'm not sure, 100% sure which one. But... It's right here. It's got four of the same uh, length, and then the back one's a little bit longer, as most Alabama rigs are. Um, but perfect little size um, for these fish right here. And what I was actually doing to catch these fish is I was looking at my little Lawrence X4 Pro fish finder, and you know, little fish finder about this wide, that big. I mean, small fish finder. Um, so you know, it doesn't. I would say it matters, but it doesn't matter. Um, but I was just circling this point I know of. And there was a hump that came like this, and it was the hump. The top of the hump was probably only 60 away from the surface, but when it came off, it dropped about 25, 30 feet, and those fish were just sitting on that little drop off. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna throw this Alabama rig out there and see if I can get some. And I actually threw it out a couple times. I felt a thump. I was like, all right, I'm getting some bites. I could just feel them hitting it. But they weren't actually eating it. Um, so I felt them. I kept casting back out there, casting back out there, casting back out there, and then one time, boom, two and a half, uh, three pound bass. Got that first one. That was the bigger one. And then I put them in a live well, cast back a couple more times, caught a little 12-incher. Um, the first one was 16 inches, well, the second one was 12. Um, so not too bad for 30 minutes of fishing, 35 minutes of fishing. If you guys do want one of these Alabama rigs, uh, mini finesse rigs, make sure to go to shanesbaits.com and go ahead and check them out. Again, that is shanesbaits.com. So I know this video wasn't as good quality as I hoped it to be just because it's getting darker out. But if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up keeps me motivated to keep making these fishing videos for you guys and I also I will be doing a review on this bait right here caught these fish off tonight um, but I hope this is the video please comment rate, subscribe and we'll see you guys later